Hi, I'm Daniel. I'm a sleep physician. And if you have insomnia, this channel is for you. Today I want to talk to you about stimulus control. It's a very important technique to master if you spend a lot of time tossing and turning at night. If you want to watch a shorter video, please check my upload from yesterday, Insomnia Insight, number five, stimulus control. There are two reasons you want to eliminate tossing and turning at night. Firstly, it feels terrible. Secondly, there are some more dire consequences to tossing and turning. Healthy sleepers associate the bed and the bedroom with sound sleep. It is a safe and comfortable environment. Insomniacs often associate the bedroom with tossing, turning, anxiety, and frustration. And this makes it even harder for them to sleep. It perpetuates, even worsens the insomnia. So what should you be doing? Well, if at the time you go to bed, or when you wake up at night, you feel like you've spent some 15, 20 minutes without looking at the time, not being able, able to fall back asleep, leave the bed, leave the bedroom, and only go back when you feel as if you can no longer stay awake. A question I often get is, what should I be doing when I've left the bedroom? You often hear that you should not watch TV, you should avoid light exposure, you should not be on a screen. It is true that strong light and uh, engaging activities can disrupt your sleep. But keep in mind, it is better that you're distracted from your attempts to sleep than that you're bored and just keep thinking about how much you want to go back to bed again. So I think anything that does not involve strong light or that is super engaging is fine. Last point here, stimulus control will only work if you have a fixed wake up time. If not, what may happen is that you wake up at let's say 2 or 3 a.m., you leave the bedroom, you only go back to bed at let's say 6 a.m., and now you sleep till 10 a.m., and then repeat the same thing next night. If you have a fixed and pretty early wake up time, then you may have nights where you sleep very little, but in the long run, you will achieve better sleep. I hope this was helpful. If it wasn't, please let me know. And I look forward to seeing you back here again. Bye for now.